Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Joji. I know everyone is dealing with this crazy world, with this difficult situation. So my advice to you guys is just stay home. Maybe try the stuff that you haven't done before. Play around with your makeup. Be creative and use what you have at home. It's going to help you keep busy and stay positive. As long as we do our part as an individual, we can hit that finish line. We are all in this together. So just stay safe everyone. Please. So today I am going to bring you some warmth because in today's video I am going to show you guys the best affordable warm tone eyeshadow palette. It is not new in the market but it's an oldie goldie eyeshadow palette. So it is the Morphe 3502 eyeshadow palette and look at this guys. I'm going to open this to show you. Look at that color. It is beautiful. It is vibrant. The colors are intense. It pays off and it's a high quality. It is pigmented. It is creamy. There are 35 shades in this palette and I think there is 21 matte finish and 11 shimmer. I'm gonna swatch some of this color for you guys. I'm gonna swatch this red right here. And let's swatch some like bronze. So as this like really dark, deep, orangey, almost red tone and this orangey brown. Do I have space? And let's swatch this right here because I wanted to see this as well. So see how it's swatched on my skin, but it also applies really nice. As you can see, I am wearing it right now. So let's just swatch this. I'm just going to do that. Look at that swatch. Like... Look at the payoff and look at the color that it shows on my skin right now. So whatever you see here, it's also the same in here. It's even better because we are blending around the eyes. But it does really look amazing. The formula is a high quality but at the same time it is affordable. So if you are looking for a nice affordable warm tone eyeshadow palette, this is the one guys. I would really recommend this for you and it will not disappoint you. So yes, after I swatch all of that, I can't wait to show you the application and so you can see how it actually applies. So let's just jump right into the video. Here you go, camera zoom in and focus. So now I am ready to apply this eyeshadow palette on my eyes. So the first color that I'm going to use is called Universal and I'm going to use my NYX number 16 blush to apply this as my transition. So taking the product, make sure you tap the excess and apply this directly on my crease. So this has not a lot of color, it's because it's a very light transition, but it's warm at the same time. So building up a little bit more with this color as your transition, definitely good. And if you guys can see the way how it blends on my eyes, it's like seamless. It's not hard to blend, I swear, like it's such a good eyeshadow palette. And as if you are wondering, I have already set my eyes with my eye primer and set it with the powder. I think we're going to go ahead and jump into the next color soon. So I'm just dipping it one more time and kind of like giving me that nice, softer, smoother, elongated look so that's what i wanted to do and to show you all right so that is pretty much the first color that we did so for the next color i am going to choose the color called orb it's in the first row again the third one so we're gonna apply that using my e25 blending so it's from sigma dipping into the product and apply it directly into my crease so giving me more depth intensity with this shade and definitely again a warm tone. This is this palette is a whole lot of warm. It's so gonna bring it a little bit to my outer eyes. Go in with my NYX brush and blend it 
this palette or this eyeshadow palette it moves really nice you can still blend it even after you finish putting it so it's not drying up it's very flexible I would say on to the next color I'm going to use the shade called spice and using my Kuo pointed crease blender I'm going to use that to apply this eyeshadow we are going darker in here but trust me guys don't have to worry with this palette everything goes well together so just applying this on the outer corner of my eyes and kind of like creating that nice V shape see even if it's like darker color my skin doesn't pick up any pigmentation okay grabbing in more product spice it up like the name spice giving more color and I'm gonna grab in my X and then blend one more time so yeah there you go guys that is the third color and we are not done yet <laughs> we are going to use the fourth color of course I'm going to show you as much as we can so let's deepen it up a little bit for the fourth color I am going to use the shade called rich and I'm using the same brush as what I use on the spice color it's the the cool just the same brush so dipping into that now this is way darker than the first three colors that we use but again i have tried this color i have used it so many times and it's it's been tested it's really good so let's just put that carefully right here and really deepen the color intensity of this look as you can also see guys, there is no fallout and that is the best. That is what you want in an eyeshadow that is, you know, affordable, applies evenly, applies amazing, the texture, the pigment, it's everything. I think it's literally like everyone's OG, like the holy grail, but I know it is an older palette, but still. Okay, so for the shimmer color into the center of my eyes, I'm going to choose the shade called Bronze. It is a very warm, bronzy color. So I'm going to use my finger to just apply this. I feel like it's the best way of applying the shimmer. And like I said, there is no fallout, so you don't have to worry. Okay, yeah, so then just gonna blend that with my brush very softly. It's everything, and that's the result, guys. You could see the warm, best ever eyeshadow palette. So I'm just gonna finish my other eye and the bronzer and the blush and the lipstick, and I will be right back. Alright, I am back with the bronzer, the blush, the lipstick, the highlighter. So now I wanted to apply an eyeshadow color onto my lower lash line. So I'm just going to use the same shades as what I use on the upper eyes. Then the spice. And then the rich color. And then after the lash line, I am going to use this shade called Pure to highlight my brow bone and to my inner eyes. Any small brush will do. So I'm going to grab that product and apply. I'm gonna pop in some liquid eyeliner and a false lashes and I will be back alright guys I am coming back with a finished eye makeup look from the morphe 3502 eyeshadow palette it is packed with solid warm colors it is easy to blend 
and I mean the colors are so amazing so I don't know what else to say about this eyeshadow palette so I hope this video helps you find the most perfect and affordable warm eyeshadow palette that you are looking for and if you find this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and also let me know in the comment section down below if you have any suggestions that you'd like to see on my next video I would love to hear it from you also Please don't forget to subscribe on my channel and hit the notification bell so that you are notified whenever I upload my next video. Thank you guys for watching. Take care and I will see you again on my next one. Bye!